caring citizens of the Twin Counties, we are happy that you are here. Um, we have very exciting news to share with you, and we have a great opportunity to help improve our community in ways that we cannot even imagine. But we need your help to do it. So thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule to be here. Um, this will be the first of many communications that you receive from us, but we want you to get all the details and tell you firsthand all the exciting things that we have going on. So I'll jump in and get started, and then at the end we will um, certainly allow time for questions and answers, and uh, make sure we answer any concerns that you might have. All right. First of all, before I proceed to that next slide, there is a website there that you need to note and write down and say in your mind by memory. We have also put it right here, so if you have it in your, on your badge of honor, which is googletwincounties.com. That is going to be the, on the tip of everyone's tongue between now and March 26. So please keep that in mind. If you forget it, we've written it right here for you, and it's also on the card that you were provided at the door. All right, fantastic. We have had a great opportunity to be a part of the uh, Google, excuse me, Google Fiber for Communities Initiative. And this particular initiative is actually a contest that's being put out across the nation by Google where they want to provide ultra high speed internet to the homes. They're calling it Fiber to Home Network. That would just have great, great value if Rocky Mount or the Twin Counties were selected. Uh, this would actually serve up to 500,000 customers, and as you can see here, would provide 100 to 500 times the current speed of internet that we have today. And you can just imagine what that would mean for your business, for your family, for uh, health care in this area, for education. I mean, the, the value of that could just be endless. Most cities in North Carolina, as well as across the United States, are submitting applications. And now the Rocky Mountain and the Twin Counties has decided to throw our hat in the ring and do the same. And we're very excited about that. There is a two-phase application process, which we are currently working through in conjunction with the city of Rocky Mount. But our meeting here today is primarily to focus on the community phase of the application, where we have to garner support for this initiative. As you saw in our first slide, and even in the current slide, we have a very short time window. Our deadline for this is March 26. So we have to rally all the support we can very quickly. And this will be a very easy task for you to help join our campaign and tell Google to please select the Twin Counties for this ultra high speed internet. Let's talk a little bit about the benefits for the Twin Counties. We've already <coughs> talked about high tech business. Think about how well we could attract businesses and industry to this area, the economic development, uh, aspects of this are absolutely huge, and we certainly want to be able to position ourselves for success by being chosen for this so we can attract more high-tech business to our area. Educational opportunities for our children will be dramatically improved. They would also be able to access more of their educational resources from home. If you think about the many laptop <coughs> initiatives that are um, in the schools today where children are being able to pr be provided access to laptops, that's great until they take it home and cannot access the internet with it. So again, this would help with educational opportunities in a number of different ways, but that's just one thing to think about. Healthcare record access. Um, I understand that uh, the healthcare, healthcare records that are being transported back and forth today between medical facilities, those are often, often having to be done by either CD or special courier in some cases, depending on the, the resources available to them. This would allow x-rays and films and MRIs and other things to be instantly transmitted uh, so that healthcare can be much faster for our community. And of course, the residential and business internet service would be much faster and allow greater downloads for file sizes, uh, print capabilities, and other media access. As I mentioned earlier, this is a two-phase process. There is the government response, which is considered phase one, and we have already partnered with the city of Rocky Mount, obviously, and they will be submitting the application for the technical side. And this actually provides information necessary to evaluate our local market, all the existing infrastructure, and of course, our total partnership potential to Google. 
What we need your help with today, though, is the community response. We need all the support that we can to submit online nominations to Google so that we will be chosen out of the many, many communities that are vying for this great um, service. So the focus of Google for Twin Counties campaign is to solicit the support. And we need your help and the help of all the foot soldiers we can get in place to get these nominations. So let's talk about what our goals are for the campaign. We need at least 1,000, and I say at least, because there are many cities that have many more than this. We need at least 1,000 community nominations to be posted to the Google Fiber for Community Initiatives site. And we're gonna provide you detailed instructions to do that. In fact, the card that you have been provided already has that on the back, if you flip that over. We also need, in turn with that, um, 3,000 local supporters through a number of different means. Social media, voice message support, other creative venues, uh, so we can actually report and track these numbers and provide them to Google as part of our overall application. It is critical that all of these are tracked so that we can report that as part of the application process. And we will talk more about that in just a minute to make sure that you can be sure your vote is counted. And of course, another really critical goal is that we, this will certainly help establish uh, local unity among our city and our counties to all buy for this great common goal. So, how can you help? What's the name of our website again? Let's see if you're listening, this is a quiz. Thank you. Google20counties.com. You'll have no test later. At this website, you can go online and submit the online nomination to Google. I'm sorry we do not have internet access in this particular building. However, it is a very simple, easy to use site, and we have made use of all the Google tools to build it. So it is a very simple site. When you go into the site in the top right corner, you will see in big red letters, submit your nomination form to Google. You also have the opportunity, if you do not have internet access, to submit a nomination over the phone. And the phone number is also provided in large red letters right at the center of that home page so that you can call and leave a recorded voice response to let Google know why they should come and build that fiber to home network here in the Twin Counties. You can also become a fan, follower, or friend on Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube. For those of you that are into social media, we want to use that as a tool to spread the word as well as to garner support for this initiative. We are going to also have an opportunity for you to sign up for email updates. Our site will have a scoreboard there on the right so you can tell how close we are to our 1,000 and how close we are to our 3,000 numbers. And also over on the left of our site on the home page, you'll see a countdown to tell you how many days are remaining. We also have, as I mentioned before, the scoreboard icon. So right under on the right where you see submit your online nomination to Google, you will see another green large text icon on the right that says post to the scoreboard. It is critical if you participate in helping this initiative that you post to that scoreboard or your vote will not count. We have to submit that in kind to